Hello, this is Mr. Collier, and today we're doing the integral of secant cubed x. And what we're going to do is we're going to split this into secant x times secant squared x dx. So you notice the thing on the left is easy to differentiate. This thing here is easy to uh, integrate. So we're going to do this by parts and let u equal secant x. And dv dx is going to be equal to secant squared x. All right, so this is easy to integrate. We get v equals tan x, and this is easy to differentiate. The derivative is secant x tan x tan x dx. All right, so this is going to be equal to the integral of uv, which is secant x tan x minus the integral of vdu, which is going to be secant x tan x tan squared x dx. Okay, now this integral here, we're going to use a, the trig identity um, 1 plus tan squared x equals secant squared x, to simplify that. Okay, so oops, there should be a minus sign there. So we're going to have secant x times 1, our, sorry, secant squared x minus 1. Okay, and then we'll simplify that. We'll get secant x tan x minus secant cubed x. And this is going to be minus, uh, minus is going to be plus uh, integral of uh, just secant x. Okay. Now, uh, let me just work at the integral of secant x. We did, I did that in a previous video. You can find the link in the description below. Uh, so we're going to have this. We're going to have plus, let me, put, uh, let me just erase that for a second. Don't forget the dx. So we've got secant cubed x dx. And this is plus, the integral of that is ln secant x plus tan x. Okay, so it looks like we got nowhere because we've got the original integral back, but if you look closely, uh, we can add this to both sides of the equation. This is on the left and this is on the right. And we get twice the integral of secant cubed x dx equals, that's just this part here, secant x tan x plus ln secant x plus tan x. Okay, so that means that the integral of secant cubed x dx equals half secant x tan x plus half ln secant x tan x, secant x plus tan x plus c, of course.